In 2024, AST Space Mobile began the era of space-based cellular broadband with some fireworks. We successfully launched and unfolded our first five Bluebird satellites, the largest ever commercial communications arrays in low Earth orbit. This is an essential step toward realizing broadband mobile connectivity for all from space. But we have achieved a lot more over the last 12 months. In 2024, Google and Verizon joined our mission to connect the unconnected as strategic partners. We also signed definitive commercial agreements with AT&T and Vodafone. We now have agreements with more than 45 cellular operators around the world, which together have 2.8 billion subscribers and counting. And through our strategic partnership with AT&T, which saw a little prime time this year, and Verizon teaming up, AST Space Mobile can target nearly 100% coverage in the continental United States with more than 5,600 cells of premium low band cellular spectrum and help close coverage gaps for up to 70% of all US cellular subscribers without the need to change devices. AST Space Mobile also secured an initial contract with the Space Development Agency as a prime contractor to the US government. This highlights the dual-use potential of our technology. Yes, our direct-to-cell satellite broadband coverage can squash dead zones around the world for end consumers. But it could also bridge connectivity gaps in times of great need, helping emergency responders work faster and more efficiently to save lives. Prior to launching the first five Bluebirds, our team in Midland, Texas worked for months to ready the satellites. 95% of AST Space Mobile's manufacturing process is vertically integrated, which means almost all production, assembly, and testing of our satellites is done in-house. We had to create this unprecedented technology from scratch. In 2024, we achieved more than 3,450 patent and patent pending claims. In the early hours of September 12th, nearly 1,000 investors, fans, industry leaders, and AST Space Mobile employees gathered at Cape Canaveral, Florida to witness history. Very, very honored to have you all waking up this early to see this together with us. People around the globe also took part in the excitement through our live webcast. If you have no idea how many cables it takes to pull that off, now you do. At 4.52 a.m. on September 12th, liftoff. And we have liftoff of the Bluebird 1 through 5 mission and the dawn of a new era for mobile connectivity. Six weeks after launch, we successfully unfolded our Bluebird 1 through 5 mission ahead of schedule. Meanwhile, on the ground, production of AST Space Mobile's newest satellites is progressing. These next generation Bluebirds will have about three times the area and 10 times the data capacity. That is thanks in part to an upgraded application specific integrated circuit or ASIC, which we finished taping out this year. This $45 million investment took about 150 person years to complete. We also secured orbital launch capacity for up to 60 satellites during 2025 and 2026 through agreements with Blue Origin and other providers. Underscoring such out-of-this-world achievements, AST Space Mobile was selected as Emerging Space Company of the Year. We also won the Gold Stevie Award for Technology Breakthrough in Communications. And Abel Avellan, our founder and CEO, was appointed to the ITU UNESCO Broadband Commission for Sustainable Development. AST Space Mobile remains on track to build a constellation that will revolutionize mobile connectivity at broadband speeds from space and begin a bold new era of connecting the unconnected.